Hey there, Site 42 staff, Dr. Theron Sherman here, and today we are reacting to SCP Class R, a live action SCP short film put together by the boys at the YouTube channel Renegade Reacts on their second channel, Renegade Films. So go to the link in the description, watch the whole video, make sure to give them a sub, because once you come back to me, I'm going to be talking all over it, we're going to talk about SCP lore, we're going to talk about film stuff, all that kind of junk. So head over there, do the thing, I'll wait here. And we're back, thank you very much. Let's get into it. But before we begin, this video is brought to you by the concept of supporting creators. Whether it's on Patreon, or on channel memberships, or Ko-Fi, whatever you do, if you're giving people money to make better art, we get to deal with less ads, less sponsorships, it's just you guys and the videos you want us to make. And that is what we're all about here, especially in the SCP community space, where things are really niche, and we're not super advertiser friendly with all the gore and horror and weird stuff. So support your favorite creators today, and we'll see you on the other side. Oh, starting out with SCP-3199 and 087. Class R. Very interesting that they're doing that thing where they take and make their own lore. I appreciate that. Let's expand the universe, not just hate the same thing every time. It's good to get creative. Is that the Hanged King? Yes, it's the Hanged King. 106, 096. This is just a reference call out. I'm Leonardo DiCaprio memeing over here. All right, let's get to it. Class R. So which facility are we going to? We aren't going to a facility. Just keep driving to the destination. They never give you all the intel. I never give you all the intel. That's right, I'm the jerk here. You shouldn't have given him the picture. What? What do you mean? He can Where hear you. Think? What if he gets cold feet again? What are you going to use then? Is there a reason for this site specifically? Yes, but that is not for us to know at this time. We will be briefed whenever we arrive. We are always in the dark until like the last minute. They never tell us nothing. Did you really think they would take this program seriously? I hoped. That's your problem. You're too hopeful. The Foundation doesn't evolve. We do the same thing in and out. Very hesitant so, uh, to change. So does that mean that your assignment to this is proof that they just don't care? They just want checks and balances on new programs. They know I'm going to be unbiased. I think they want it to fail. Knowing them, they can never stand for things to change. I said... You of all people should know that they are always willing to change. They just need to be convinced. Maybe. I guess we'll see. They had to drive a long way for it to get dark out here. What's in the box? No, What's in the box? This is the assignment we've been given. I was told that our trials would be, be at a testing facility. Things change. This is our assignment now. I was told that our first one would be a safe class object. And it is, mostly. Europe has had full control since its discovery. And now that the coordinates are stateside, this is our opportunity to make progress. This isn't what I was promised. You do not have the luxury of making objections. These are the orders given to us. Take it or leave it. I need more time to prep my subject. Ten minutes. The punishment for not following orders to the letter is steep. Indeed, we do not ask questions. We follow blindly. What could possibly go wrong? What is this place? It's the site of our first test. Nah. Where are we? Look, we don't have that much time. I'll answer as many questions as I can, but I only have ten minutes to get you prepped. So please. I'm just saying, Renegade Gang, I would like a better patch on his jumpsuit. 
That one looks a little weird to me. I like this bubble though. That's a good bubble. Great as a containment site and great as a way to have a set on the cheap. Okay, so here's the rundown. You'll be fitted with tracking and recording equipment. Once you have the equipment, you'll be led to the door. Once at the door, you'll be given the key. You'll then use the key to open the door. Now, once you are inside the door, there will be a forest. Once inside the forest, the door will close and it cannot be reopened from within. The overall objective is to survey the inside of the anomaly. Wait, 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 wait. What the hell are you talking about? A forest? A path? I'm telling you what to expect whenever you're inside. A forest. In there. Look, y'all on some bullshit. Look, we don't have that much time. We they never five believe. five minutes before they grab you. They never they believe. They the equipment, and then they're sending you in. This is... This is... Crazy. Look, I know you won't believe it until you see it. Trust me, I was the exact same way. I. So what you need me to do? You've been outfitted with a GPS transponder for tracking, a two-way high-frequency radio for communication, and a camera which will be going directly to us. We'll be recording at all times. See the pirate the patch. Primary okay, directive the of this helmet exercise patch. is to attempt to map out the immediate area inside. And how am I supposed to do that with this? Every one of these is a sonar device. And once we have enough of them inside, we'll be able to get the lay of the land. Every one of these can cover up to a 200 meter area. You're to take one of these and toss it every 50 meters on either side of the pathway. That sounds easy enough. You must ensure that all equipment you've been given is returned in working order. Begin the test. We really don't like it when you break our stuff. It's expensive. Approach the door. You don't gotta shove him. He can walk. Take the key attached to your vest and open the door. Yeah. Yeah, I'm here. I'm trying to guess if this is fog filter or if they actually did some like fog machine out there. Right. Fine. Cause that's a lot of fog otherwise. I I, I feel like that's VFX. This is a very expensive piece of technology. Chuck it into the woods. Don't hit a tree. Yo, how is this even possible? We don't really know. Anomalies like this are rarely understood. Come to think of it, how are we even talking like this? Results of previous experiments. Yo, this shit is a trip. Let us know if you see anything odd. For real? Did you just... Say again? Yo, did you just hear that? 
We didn't hear anything on our end. So, like, the whole forest is green screen then, right? Is that what I'm seeing? I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just trying to understand their filmmaking process. I'm always interested in the BTS. I want to know what Take they're doing. The and, just, and throw it straight in front of you. I want to know what they're doing. That way we can do it later. If you throw one in front of you, I can tell you which way to go. Okay, the readout shows that the path goes mostly straight after 20 meters, and then it goes left, and after another 10, it goes right. What do you think you're doing? What do you mean? He's wasting assets. His objective is to survey as much of the inside as possible. How can he do that if he's wasting assets? How the hell is he supposed to survey the inside if he can't see 10 feet in front of him? Throw another disc. It's always yap, yap, yap with the bosses both ways. Oh, don't waste the assets. We could lose a D class or an R class. Meh, 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 meh. Hey. I'm here. What happened? Yo, did you just hear that? I didn't hear anything. Are you hearing voices? You never want to hear, Can did you, you just hear that? that? Last minute on the recorder? Always yes, bad. I need you to dissect every last minute of that audio. Let yes, me know what you find. It would seem we have a dead zone in the area we've mapped. The hell? How long has it been like this? Since the last pulse from the survey disk just a moment ago. It eats sonar. Typical. Let me know if any more dead zones pop up. Can do. Flaws on the readout. Do you see it? Nah. I, I can't see. Is it a friend? No, it's not a friend. It's never a friend. The wall is on our readout. Do you see it? You, you left your thingy. You left your thingy. I thought the door can't be reopened from the inside. I guess someone oh, opened oh, it for him. Easy. You're back. Yo, get this shit off me! They must have opened Can it we get this off They're nice guys. We're so uh, nice. He's not finished. What the hell are you talking about? He failed to return all the equipment. He lost the camera. But what the fuck does that shit even matter? If I want your opinion, R001, I'll ask for it. He did everything we asked for. Everything. You're really gonna jam this up over a camera? He was told what to do, and he failed. In order for this op to be declared a success, all equipment must be... The Foundation must be on hard times if they're getting this mad over a GoPro. Go fuck oh my word. I'm done. Can't you buy those at a gas station nowadays? I don't think you understand the situation. You either do this, or we put you in a hole for the rest of your life. What are you talking about? Now that you've seen what's in there, there's no going back. It's that simple. So you saying, either I do this, or I'm basically a ghost? Pretty much. Swayze. Swayze. This isn't how it was supposed to go. He did everything. Hey! He's on your side, man. I mean, not really. No, he we deserve Are that. Done? Get him up. <sighs> now that I have your undivided attention, I need an answer. Are you going to do this or not? I am about to die for this shit. I say. Since you are not going to cooperate, I don't see why we need to keep this. Hey. Oh. 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 
three guards like that. He got three. Our friend here's a real badass. Sir, please. This isn't necessary. He did everything we needed. Who are you to determine what's necessary? Have you forgotten what happens if I declare this a failure? What happens to you? Get out of my way. Have you had a moment to clear your head? Cute kid. It's a shame he will never know you. What are the odds he'll get back to him anyways? What we asked you to do. We just need the camera. That's all. You do that, you're one step closer to your goal. You know what we do to one D class. I can't imagine what we do to R class. Do you understand? R zero zero one. Oh, I got you. Get back to your station. Fix this mess. I'm wondering about the windows and such on either side. Are the so there's a big factory with a door in it. I see that. Okay. I'm wondering why they set up the bubble tent for their computer base, but I guess why not? You can just kind of set up in any office, right? I guess a running start will help. Although I thought he was running away. Maybe that's just the way it was like filmed or something. Ooh, it's Haha. <laughs> Can't you see I am you? Ha ha ha. Is this one of ours? Well done, R001. As a reward, you can have this. <laughs> Myers, log everything, gather all the info for oversight. Also, get him situated and prepared for transport. Sir, you need to come hear this. Is this one of our anomalies on the wiki or is this original? I'm not familiar with this one. Myers, and I think that was Death Awaits You. Mission one, success. Ugh. Episode one, The Blue Key. Well, nice, that tells us they want to make more. All right. Let's see what we got here in SCP-860, huh? SCP-860, who are you? 860, maybe you are titled the blue key. It's a blue key. Contained in a small wooden box in a vault at Sector Redacted. Why would we redact this actor? Then we can't find it. 860 is a dark blue key of unremarkable shape. It's seemingly random intervals of time, a series of numbers found to be a UTM coordinates will appear on the key's blade. In the time at 860 spent on containment, the numbers have changed three times for a German new place, an England place, and site redacted. And again, we're redacting the places so we can't find them in our own official documents. My classification level is pretty high. This should not be redacted. Fit in any door lock that requires a key located in the area of the given coordinates, it will function identically to the correct key for the lock. So it's not a random door in a workshop. It's just the key that'll unlock doors. Uh, the door did not lead to its usual designation, said it opens to a small forest clearing with an 80 centimeter wide footpath, blue colored mist. When the person enters the door, it automatically closes from inside. The door appears attached to an infinite concrete wall and is locked. No attempts to break the door from outside with personnel inside 860-1 have been successful. Attempts to break the door from inside 860-1 have re resulted in redacted. God, we used to do this too much back in the old days. 
Although I guess something bad happening, but we should know what the something bad is. We work here. I wonder what an R class did that a D class wouldn't be good for. Because we are D class testing this anomaly. And so I would be interested in asking the renegades what the R class is about and why it benefited foundation overseers slash site directors, whoever was in charge of that call, to put it onto something we're already testing with D-Class. Okay, so overall, what do I think? What do I think overall? So that was a pretty fun little short film. Uh, the production quality looked pretty solid. I, you know, it's low budget, but that's what low budget is. We're trying to build something here. We're not gonna be filming feature films until we get much bigger budgets. Uh, the acting was solid. Uh, Mr. Boss Man was definitely a highlight. Very serious business. Uh, <laughs> I got little inner chuckle from the ghost Swayze. Ah, that's good. I wonder, I guess the Renegade guys must have written that or something. Uh, him taking out the three mobile task force guys surprised me. I feel like uh, unless he is the best of the best of the best and ended up in prison. And so that's why he's class R, he's like a special recruit. But taking out the the guards like that, I, I don't see that coming CQC. Uh, but hey, uh, other things have happened and this is fiction after all. We can let things go and he did quickly get taken down after that. And okay, so the entity is calling out at Myers. So when they do episode two, I guess that not only will our class R come back, but also Myers will be involved, probably more of a recurring cast. Interesting. Well, tell me what you thought in the comments because I liked it well enough. I'd like to see more of it and see how it proceeds. I'd like to see what happens if we do a team up and get everybody in the community involved in making bigger and better projects. We pool our resources. We can make our SCP big budget action movies or shows sooner than later. So as I said before, make sure to support the creators around the best you can. Like, sub, subscribe, Patreon, channel member, donate, anything you can do to help us make bigger and better SCP films, movies, games, shows, all that good stuff. In the meantime, I've been Dr. Theron Sherman, and I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you for listening. Site42 Studios and its staff are funded by viewers like you. Please become a patron or visit our merch store at the link in our bio to support our work. Secure. Contain. Protect.